Assalamu alaikum. Hey guys, what's up? I hope you all are doing well. Today, I'm gonna be looking at GPing process of Geo database and uh, shift files, which are commonly found and used in ArcGIS, particularly ArcMap by geographer, urban planner, and other professionals who are acquainted with geographic information system and remote sensing. So, uh, some problem that can be arised while working on uh, geodatabase and converting this geodatabase into uh, GIP, GIP form. So uh, that's a problem uh, I will be focusing on today and I will try to come up with a solution. Okay, for example, let's say uh, right now I have been working on ArcMap I initiate a file called uh, Shunamgons district that's the northwest and western part of Bangladesh and this is the geo database where I have collected from uh, geo database Shunamgons so uh, let's assume I have completed my work and I'm working under a boss and he is super cool super active he uh, monitors me every day as a result uh, today he pushes me up to upload my data into Google Drive so that he can I mean check it out so to do so what I have to do I have to make my database file uh, I mean yeah, into a compressed one or a zip one so that it can be smaller in size and also handy to send by me uh, <clears throat> so to do so, first of all, I have to shut my, uh, I mean, ArcMap down. Uh, why? Because sometimes it raises some issues while chipping or, or compressing. Uh, that's why I have to put it off and I have done it. And then I have to search the location where my, uh, I mean, actual geodatabase is stored. So from... Uh, that uh, arc map I have uh, located my directories and which is under tutorial file under F drive or educational drive so let's enter into tutorial files here are two files I have just set up for you one is the original file that I was working on in arc map and the other one this is the version of the upper one and actually, uh, I, I will be investigating today how this file has come up and what's the problem associated with this uh, file. Yeah, uh, first of all, let me just show you this is nothing but a PDF file and this has stemmed from a geo database. How did it, uh, does it come? Yeah. Before that, uh, let me just tell you what we do usually to uh, convert our file into zip form. We just click uh, the right button of that file and go to the, I mean, add to archive uh, option of any zipping software. For example, I have been using 7-zip file for a long time, so uh, it is also there right now. I will be using that. So if I just click add to archive, the process uh, will be beginning. Yeah, what comes up? Let's see. And uh, the process uh, of compressing has begun and it will take time. Uh, so uh, just let me get rid of it so that my video won't be so longer. Uh, and for your information for your I mean ease, easiness I have just made it earlier for you guys and this is the outcome of the I mean uh, jeeping process if we had gone to I mean using archive method so uh, this is a PDF file which is not usable or handy in ArcMap so that's why we have to go otherwise and what is the otherwise an alternative method of uh, jipping the file today uh, i will be i mean taking you to that path
first of all uh, we have to enter the main geodatabase file yeah I have done this and then uh, we'll have some sort of some bunch of file associated or linked together the problem is that for a novice and amateur I mean uh, user of uh, ArcGIS or ArcMath they usually get daunted and having seen this source of uh, I mean gigantic files uh, uh, all together numerous file are and they just I mean skip it uh, avoid it but here is a trick you have to just uh, select all the files by clicking ctrl plus a button and I have followed that method and it's already done then the next step is that you have to press the right button of your mouse yeah I have done this and just go down from top to uh, sixth option here is send to from send to you have to just I mean turn uh, right and go to compress zipped folder this option this is our destination where we can uh, hit on the final button to make the GIF, the GIF form okay let's see what happened yeah uh, it's started and it perhaps will take you few seconds even for some time uh, for a few minutes as well so uh, here is the direction about 40 seconds are remaining to make it happen once it's done you will be directed to such source of file the icon demonstrate that it's a complete uh, I mean okay it's a complete uh, GIF file that we were expecting and our result is our uh, in our hand and we are very much pleased and happy uh, to have this source of file okay the next thing is that this is uh, as as usual a uh, I mean customer move, uh, file system whatever name you wanna insert you are allowed to do that uh, as for the original name I will be I mean inserting that name as well okay so let me just type shunam guns dot view data is and then press the enter button okay it's done right now just click and cart and then paste here now I look at these three files and try to compare the first one the original one and the second one that was the unexpected outcome of our error process uh, unfortunately and the last one that is the uh, complete one that is the expected one we were wanting okay so this is how we can crack this problem and this is how uh, we can make our file handy and easy in a GIF form.